morning. I have very low battery today and I don't have a new battery. So let's get inside and I'll tell you everything later. I cannot believe it. This is a big deal, big day, big appointment, and my battery is flashing in the corner. So we are just gonna have to wait and see and see how much of this appointment that we get on the vlog, and I will tell you all about it. Been on my mind, sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light. Hey, darling, we could get out of town, see the beautiful world around, wanna see it now. Pack our bags and get in that car. real far let's get out we can leave this city let's drive to the open air yeah the countryside is so pretty with the wind blowing in your hair we can look back someday baby don't you understand Much better. What is on that? <gasps> Will you stop touching our friends in a weird way? I kind of liked the phone footage. I thought that was a re really good quality. But we're back. But I wanted to tell Philip how today's appointment went and my thoughts on what's next. Oh, and I'll talk over the heater for a second. If you notice, we are still at Mimi and Papa's house. Uh, Philip did his sweet make people like you commentary and talked to the neighbor and said one more night and then we're leaving so we got one more night and if you guys didn't see that yesterday's video I had a little mix hat with being in this kind of vehicle and how people have very strong feelings about this being around them. Philip and I are very ready to be, oh, Philip's probably right. I tried new makeup today and it's a little shiny. Oh well. We've been saying this for a little while, but I'm saying it straightforward. Um, the comments here on YouTube are question mark. At this point, we don't know if comments are allowed or not. If they're not, we are still trying to at least have engagement over on Instagram by posting a photo and like ha allowing us to have comments there. I don't know when they're gonna be turned back on. We tried to do that for a little while, approving comments, and then um, they got taken down completely. So a lot of the vlogs here in the family realm with children are completely disabled or they're in the process, and they were being told that it is coming, that theirs are gonna be turned off too. So I'm thankful for what they're doing, but I'm really, really, really excited to be talking to you guys again. And I'm really hoping that when we are doing our IVF and things like that. I like talking to you guys a lot. So hopefully by then it will be back on. Again, go on our Instagrams and our Twitter. Twitter, we are super active. We'll get right back to you. Um, Instagram, leave it on the post. Um, I comment back there. And if there are any pressing things that you really need to get in touch with us, we do have an email. We have a really hard time getting back to the email, so our quickest are the social medias. Wow, wow. Shoot. How are you going to not spray the side of your RV while you're getting the spaces right here? The only time you're gonna see the paint is when it's popped out. So when you pop it out, paint it, and if some of the wall doesn't get painted, that's fine, because you're not gonna see it. Okay. It doesn't matter. You're the boss, boss. I'm the boss. Okay, guys. One thing I forgot to mention is over on my channel, 
thank goodness for it being not as big or maybe it's not a family channel or maybe it's considered a mommy channel i don't know what it's considered but comments are still over there so i'm approving comments right now our engagement story went live um a while ago for you guys and that's the comments i'm approving so you can go over there and interact with me at least over there also let me know what videos um you would like i have like a whole list that i'm already in the works with but once those are through maybe i will try to get to some of your ideas there's so much to do but i want to still tell them um how appointment went today so i saw you saw i had issues with the battery so on my right hand side i have 11 eggs on my left hand side i have five so 16 total still great um but um not as awesome as last time plus do you see what we're in the middle of? We are literally in the smack dab middle of like the hardest part of the remodel. And so I... Maybe answering service, this is Lisa. So the hardest part of the remodel is going on right now. We are going to paint this room today. I'm so excited, but painting and flooring. And so I feel very happy with uh, just us focusing on this for the next 26 days and getting a couple things in order. I didn't get my meds, so scrambling to get meds and just a couple other things we we're looking at. We didn't get into the appointment for the urologist for Philip. I just want to hear what he has to say. So just a couple of things that we are just going to wait through this cycle. And to be totally honest with you guys, a couple of days ago, I just prayed and I said, I want to know like, when are we supposed to do this? And instantly I had this like just gut feeling of not this cycle. So I'm just going to go with that and trust that and believe in that and just say, that's okay. I want to do it right this time, not fast. I have tried to do IVF, infertility, IUI, everything fast. And you have seen how it was worked out. We didn't do anything wrong, but hopefully being patient, calm, and just getting everything in order before we just like scramble to try to get meds and everything. Like, anyways, but look. This is getting there, this is getting there, and I think in a few days this RV is going to be totally transformed, it's going to start feeling like a home, and I feel like that'll help reduce stress too, because you don't want to be stressed, I don't want to feel like this is still in shambles, I want it to feel a little more put together, and just doing, like next cycle I'll be doing more finishing touches on the RV, and doing IVF and I want to commit oh, I want to commit to daily vlogging huh, through the retrieval process maybe we'll miss one or two days like maybe we'll take Sundays off but trying to do daily vlogging through that because so many of you guys ooh, sanding gross um, so many of you guys want to know what it's going to be like if you are pursuing fertility treatments maybe you've done it you want to know what's different or maybe you guys have never been through this and you're curious and you want to come along and our old retrieval videos are old that was when we like didn't know what we were filming or how to film i mean it was cute so we'll leave a card so you can watch our old retrieval playlist it was fun we did a lot of singing but this cycle of a retrieval i want to try to do daily to really show you what it's like so with that being the case i am not ready to start that today so 26 more days guys and as long as my egg count doesn't drop let's all pray for that that it doesn't drop we will be doing IVF egg retrieval in less than a month uh, hello this one's called Kimberly. hi let me hi little friends come on slippers I have slippers on why because I thought it would be cute. Is this not cute? Pajamas? They're kind of like pajamas. <laughs> Wait, I thought this had a hood. Is that the hood? You're wearing the hood. How do I keep it up? You, look like you put on your, your thing, you look your like mask. Grinch. Put on a mask. You, you look like Grinch. I do look like the Grinch. Should I be nicer than the Grinch? Or? <laughs> nicer than the Grinch. I can show you. What? Did you get that treat today?
obnoxious. Well, Philip and his dad got the RV back to the storage unit, and we are home. That was a long, good few days of successful work, but I got a message from my doctor. I was saying that I wasn't in a place, I just didn't feel like this was the right cycle, and my lab work came back and my FSH was 10. They wanted 10 or below to move forward, um, but I think because your FSH can change each cycle, um, she even felt like she wouldn't have wanted to move forward this cycle anyways. With my five and my 11, it's a good number, but she just doesn't think that it's my best. So even if I wanted to move forward, Callie's crying out for daddy. Even if I wanted to move forward and say that this is the month that I wanted to do a egg retrieval, my doctor would say, nope, not this cycle. So anyways, we all now are waiting. You are waiting, we are waiting. We're all gonna wait together and we are going to do a retrieval next cycle. Hopefully, <laughs> let's, let's hope that everything looks good next cycle but that is giving us a good deadline to try to get everything done on the RV major projects done in the next four weeks. So wish us luck. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching today. If you haven't already hit that subscribe button and go ahead and like this video, like that IVF is coming. I'm very excited and I'm excited to bring you guys along. So we'll see you guys in the next video. Go let your love multiply. Good night. Don't you know that you're